Hey guys, today we have an iPad second generation. But we're going to be installing a new color on this device today. This is the new champagne gold with a nice reflective matte finish. Now in the video, it may look a little lighter than in actual person. But it is a nice color that will match your new gold iPhone 6. So to start off, we're going to install the Type 1 back onto our iPad. You want to completely remove the skin from the wax backing, and you want to reapply it by only exposing the camera eye volume control buttons and the speakers located on the bottom left hand corner. Now these exposed sections you want to use as your pivot points to keep the back skin flat and nice and even against the iPad. You want to start by centering the camera and then guiding it and aligning it around the speaker cutout. Once you feel like that side is nice and centered, you want to press the area that is exposed underneath down onto the iPad. Lift and remove the rest of the wax backing, and then the rest of the back skin should align itself into place. Now, while laying it flat down, there might be a small accumulation of air pockets that develop underneath the skin, but firmly pressing from the center out to the sides will clear all those out. Now, before we get to the sides, you want to press around the curved edges of the iPad just to start to develop the curve, and then give a nice distance from each corner about three finger lengths. It's about a two inch radius around each corner. And then you want to leave those corner, uh, corners lifted. Now, with our average household hair dryer, we're going to heat the said lifted corners. You can see, right as soon as heat gets applied to the material, it starts to soften and adds a little bit more flexibility to the material. Now when pressing it down, you want to press in about a circular style motion firmly with your thumb, and also press down the lengths of the sides. As you can see here, I do have a piece of foam on the underneath protecting the screen of this iPad. Now we're going to continue on with the upper section located around the camera eye area. You want to firmly press it in the middle, and then, like I said previously, in a circular motion, press around the curve. Now for this final corner, we'll show you in a close-up. Once heat is applied, the material starts to soften. You want to press it firmly in the middle, and then press one side firmly down, and then in a circular motion, go down the longer length of the side. Alright guys, now it's on to the front screen of this iPad. We're going to be installing the champagne gold, as we did on the back. We're not, we're not going to be able to show you how to install the home button, but we're going to continue on with the rest of the screen bezel. Now to align this piece correctly, you want to align the sensor and the camera eye located at the center top of this device. Now you want to make sure that there's a nice even border around the outer edge of the skin and that it's centered within the camera eye as well. Now that you have this area installed and firmly pressed down, you want to gradually bring down the lower section and center it around the home button as well. Now while centering the bottom, if you pull too rough, you might be able to actually stretch over the actual screen. So you want to do that nice and gently. And then once it's installed, you want to firmly press it down and make sure that it's nice and adhered to your device. Alright guys, this has been the iPad 2 in the new Champagne Gold.
Thanks for watching.